Hi, this is Gary with MacMost Now. On today's episode, let's look at adding page numbers to your pages documents. So let's create a new pages document here and we'll just use the blank word processing template. And now say we want to have page numbers at the bottom of each one of our pages. Well, the way to do that is to add it into the footer. So first let's go and view uh, things showing the layout. So this will make it a little easier for us to see things. We can see there's the header, there's the main body, and at the bottom here we have the footer. Let's increase the size here of the page even more uh, so we can see this a little more easily. So there we go, we have the footer there at the bottom. Okay, so now we want to insert the page number here. So we can do that pretty easily by saying insert and then there's various things we could insert here. We can say page number and right there it will show number one. Now if actually I would paste a bunch of text into here and I put some sample text and you can see now there's four pages here and at the bottom of this page it says four and at the bottom of this page it says three. Now let's make it look a little nicer by selecting it and then centering the text right there. Now you can see it and does that since it's the footer. It's going to do that in each footer right there. Now let's continue to customize. Let's say if we want to show the total number of pages so we can say of and then we'll insert the page count. So there we go. Now it says 3 of 4, 2 of 4, etc. So if I were to actually paste in say more text here we can see now it's updated it. So it's now 7 of 8 and 8 of 8. Now suppose we wanted to put this at the top of the page instead. Uh, we can certainly do that uh, by uh, inserting the same thing here, page number of and page count like that. Maybe right justify it. Now suppose I have facing pages. Let's make some adjustments here. Let's uh, bring up the inspector here and under document set it to be facing pages. So this is like if you have pages in a, uh, in a book and you're doing two sided on paper. Let's actually uh, make it easier to see here by reducing the, the size down to 75% there. And now we can see here is page one is up front, and then we have two and three face each other, and four and five face each other. What would be nice is if we had the uh, page numbers uh, appear on the outside always, instead of always right justified. That's something you might typically see in a book. Uh, we can do that by going in the inspector here. We have facing pages turned on already. We can go into the layout area, into section, and you can say left and right pages are different. And what this will do is it'll redefine the headers here. Um, so the headers for the right side pages are still there. That's what we had before. But now we have to recreate the header for the left side. So insert a page number of uh, page count. And now we can see here we've got a different header, left justified on that side and a right justified header on this side here. Uh, also because we had created the footers before we're going to either have to delete these which is probably what we want to do in this case or recreate it over here so that they, they match. So that's how to add page numbers and page count to the headers and footers of your word processing documents in Pages. Hope you found this useful. Till next time, this is Gary with MacMost Now. Want more video tutorials? Just go to MacMost.com, click on the Videos link at the top of the page, and then you can view all of the hundreds of MacMost videos by category.